Hi everyone, this will be a quick video to show you a cool gadget I found at CDR King. This is a universal USB battery charger. Basically, you can take a battery like this, for instance from a camera, plug it into this and then charge it via USB. Now, what I used to do is put it into the original charger and then plug this into the wall. But there's two problems. When I'm charging multiple batteries, I have to wait for it to finish, take it out, put the next one in, and so on. The other thing is it has to be plugged into a wall. So if I'm on the road, there's nothing I can do. Now, this one is really useful because it's USB, so I can plug it into a power bank. And it's fully adjustable, so you can see those two metal pins there. And basically you adjust them to match up with the pins here on the battery. Now you do not have to worry about polarity, the positive and negative. It doesn't matter which way you put it, as long as you put it on the positive pin and the negative pin. So let me attach it to this and show you how it looks. So if you look here, you can see the pins are connected on the battery and the green light has come on to indicate it's working. So let's plug that into a USB power bank. And now it's plugged into the power bank, you can see the red light has come on and it's charging. And it's really that simple, it's basically universal. So as long as you have access to the contacts like this, then you can charge it. And pretty much every battery has markings on it to indicate which ones are the positive and negative. And like I said, you don't have to worry about polarity. As long as you connect it to the positive and negative, that's enough already. Now when I bought this, the packaging said it was capable of charging at 500 milliamp. But when we look at my tester here, it's only charging at about 260 milliamp. Um, so not even half an amp. So it's definitely gonna be a little bit slower. Uh, if you compare it against this, this charges at 700 milliamp, whereas this one is say 270. So it is gonna be slower, um, but it's portable. That's quite important to me. Now what I might do in the future is buy a second one of these. These were really cheap by the way. Um, I think it was 50 pesos, so around $1, one pound, something like that. Um, what I might do is buy another one of these and then replace the board inside with a TP4056, which can charge at a much higher rate. Um, although I might limit it to something like half an amp. Um, because the hardest part is actually the adjustable pins. Um, that's the bit that is difficult to, you know, to make it work. Because it clamps onto the battery and then the pins push against it. And they've got a little bit of bend to them. Um, so that's actually the hardest bit. The electronics inside are very simple. So yeah, that was just a quick video. Um, like I said, you could use it for cell phone batteries, you could use it for camera batteries, various different types of batteries, and it's portable. So if you did enjoy this video, please give a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.